Leave it to Beaver actor Ken Osmond dies at age 76, John Oliver cautions against the hasty return of sporting events, and Hollywood remembers Fred Willard. First, Ken Osmond, the Leave it to Beaver actor known for his convincing portrayal of Eddie Haskell on two iterations of the classic TV comedy, has died. He was 76. You call me mom? Yes, Wally. Good morning, Mrs. Cleaver. That's a very pretty dress. Thank you. His son Eric said in a statement on Monday, He was an incredibly kind and wonderful father. He had his family gathered around him when he passed. He was loved and will be very missed. Next, John Oliver cautioned sports fans during last week tonight that no matter how much they are craving the return of live sporting events, the question is, how can that safely happen? THR's Neha Joy has more. The host noted how Florida had decided early on that professional sports and media production with a national audience was essential as long as the public was unable to attend, leading the WWE, AEW, and UFC to proceed with fights. However, a UFC fighter and two of his cornermen had recently tested positive. If you want to come back completely without risk, that's just not possible right now. Oliver then turned to Major League Baseball, which at first said it would stage all games in Arizona and put players in hotel rooms. It all becomes much, much more complicated because, of course, you wouldn't just be isolating players. He noted, in addition to players, there are coaching staff, team physicians, umpires, camera crews, and many more people behind the scenes that need to be isolated and cited that a scenario like that would require around 10,000 people to be isolated, all of whom would need to be constantly tested. And Hollywood is remembering Fred Willard, the Emmy-nominated and clever comic actor who played clueless characters to perfection on Fernwood Tonight and Everybody Loves Raymond. He died on Friday at the age of 86. Hollywood stars were quick to pay tribute to the actor on social media. Steve Carell, who starred alongside Willard in both Anchorman films, remembered him for being the funniest person that I've ever worked with. He was a sweet, wonderful man. Meanwhile, Steve Martin tweeted, Rest in peace, Fred. You were always my comic hero. I was thrilled to work with you in Roxanne. For more on all these stories, head to THR.com. For The Hollywood Reporter News, I'm Tiffany Taylor.